Hey guys, Andy here with uh, another speed and strength and skills uh, homework, soccer coaching homework for you guys. This is for my club team. We're on a break for the next few weeks. This is your homework, you guys. But I figured I'd post it here. Uh, some of you guys coach soccer, have little ones who play. You can have them do this homework as well. So to start off, we're just gonna do a little bit of bounding. This is really to work on our stabilization, our leg strength, and our balance. And still working on our athletic posture. So we're gonna do single leg stuff tonight. So you guys, we're just gonna work on level one is just balancing. A couple of coaching tips are find something to stare at on the ground and that'll help you balance. So 10 seconds on one leg, switch, 10 seconds on the other leg. Try to keep an athletic position, numbers up, balancing on that leg, not letting the knee go a wild and not standing up, not putting your weight on your heel, you're in an athletic position. That's first progression. Second level is just going to be changing. So move over just a little bit, bud. Right there, guys. Okay. You're just going to change. So five seconds on this leg. Hop. Five seconds on this leg. So we want to catch ourselves in a stabilization. Five seconds. Five seconds. Five seconds. And then the third and final progression there is we're going to hop forward. So we're gonna balance for five seconds, and then we're actually going to bound forward and catch ourselves. Five seconds there, bound forward and catch ourselves. Okay, so this is our first time. Obviously, we're all still learning this, but this is really good for your power, your explosiveness, your stabilization, even your core is getting activated while you're doing this. So level one, 10 seconds each leg. Level two is the switch. And then level three is hopping and catching yourselves. For your homework, guys, why don't you try doing three rounds of that, all three progressions, every other day for the next couple weeks. And just that, that'll be like a little bit of a workout for you. And then with the ball, our skill for tonight, you guys want to get your ball? Tonight we're talking about... How do we get that ball down back to the floor, back to the ground, if it's bouncing in the air? And I don't like it when I see guys or, or boys or girls putting their foot on top of the ball like that. It always throws you a little bit off balance. Sometimes the ball goes under your foot. So level one, step one, is just dropping the ball, letting it hit your foot down to the ground right in front of you. So just drop it from your, like your belt, your waist, and letting it hit the ground in front of you, you settle it down dead. Level two is tossing the ball up. We're getting a little bit more progressed here and just let the ball die right in front of you, okay? Try that with your right foot and with your left foot. And then finally, progression three is you're going to do that same move, but you're gonna turn out of it. Because I told these guys as a defender, if I saw someone who was about to take the ball down in front of me, I'd be licking my chops to go in and steal that ball or give them a nice hard tackle. So you don't wanna stay put with your head down or you get crunched. So watch this guys, we're gonna just turn out, turn out with the ball, okay? So when you toss it, try to bring it down and turn out and accelerate away. Give it a toss, turn out and move it away with the ball. All right, so there you have it guys. There's your speed and strength for tonight and your skill also. There's your homework for the next couple weeks. I'll see you guys then. Talk to you soon.